What's up guys? Welcome back to another vlog. As you can tell by the title, this one is a vlog. It's a little bit of a travel vlog. I'm going to San Francisco in like an hour um, for work with Sephora Collection. And I'm so excited. I am going to be vlogging the whole experience, all the new products, just my travel day. Just, you know, like a little weekly, daily vlog like I normally do. Um, because you guys seem to love these videos. I also am going to start this kind of like new thing on my channel because I've been vlogging so much and I feel like people are getting confused like which videos are going to be vlogged which videos are going to be like normal sit down videos so every single vlog I'm gonna have like I'm gonna start like a little series on my channel and it's just gonna be like vlogs whatever but each title is gonna be like vlog one and then like the rest of the title vlog two the rest of the title just so you guys know which videos are vlogs because a lot of people come to my channel for the vlogs so it'll be super easy to tell Literally nothing's changing ex about my vlogs except the title. I am currently in my room. I have to call myself a car pretty soon. I will show you guys the whole shebang. So this is my suitcase. It's all packed up. I think I have everything. I really, really hope I have everything. And this is what I'm wearing. I will show you guys. Just ignore this part of my bathroom. But this is what I'm wearing. Um, a hoodie from Shadow Hill. Leggings from Lulu Lemon, and then my Air Force Ones, and they're high top. So I'll catch up with you guys a little bit later when I start my travel day and stuff. I have to pack up a few more things, but I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to subscribe if you're new here, and let's go to San Francisco. Hey guys, so I just landed, just got off the plane, going to the hotel right now. I will vlog when I get there. Hi guys, so I just got to my hotel room and I will give you guys a little tour, it's really cute. Okay, so you walk in and then it's just this little room, it's so cute, a bed, me. I'm assuming this is the bathroom. <gasps> yeah, it is. Where's the lights? <laughs> oh my god, stop. Aw, that's so cute. It's like they knew I was coming. Just kidding. Okay, and then also, all this cuteness. Oh my god, there's a robe with my name on it. That's a dream, when you want perfect lipstick, but you also want tacos. Feel that. This is so awesome. What is all this? Oh my god, it's a curling iron, a flat iron, and a blow dryer. I wish I didn't bring all my hair stuff. Dang. And then I think these are the new products that I get to show you guys. Lashes, palettes, and they hooked it up. I am gonna order some room service right now cause I've been traveling and I haven't eaten. I'm gonna text Summer and see if she's here and wants to hang out with me. <laughs> guys, this looks so good. I got a turkey wrap, chips, a side of avocado, some fruit, a water, and I'm watching Trisha and Jason's video because you guys know I'm obsessed with Trisha like it's a really weird obsession I have I don't know what's wrong with me literally my only YouTube goal is to do a mukbang with Trisha Paytas but yeah this was the start of my vlog so see you guys in the morning hi guys so I'm on the way to Sephora headquarters right now and I will keep you guys updated and vlog when I'm there and stuff but yeah just a little update saying hi this morning because I really haven't done any sort of vlogging at all and I'm a mess, basically. <laughs> going <laughs> we're lost we're trying to find sport headquarters so here we go <laughs> we made it what is all this <laughs> sandwiches different kinds of salads this looks like a garden salad with like chickpeas and um, avocado this looks like a taco salad this looks like a spinach and bacon and um, apple that looks like walnuts, goat cheese, cranberries. Oh. <laughs> Wait, oh I'm nervous. <laughs> Did you guys know Tan Lines was my favorite? Oh my God, guys, it's me. 
I feel weird, I'm in a bikini on mine. Is that weird to like put on my lips? Oh my god, I love this. This is my own, one of my favorite shades too. Like there is perfect. I'm looking into how to make this uh, available in stores. So Heidi and I are working um, with all of the different um, go into the store and I did a complete outfit change because I was way way too hot in my turtleneck so now I'm just in like this and I took my hair out I don't know I just wanted to switch it up a little bit I don't really know where we're going next it's 1 15 right now and we're gonna explore San Francisco which I'm really excited about since I've never been here also really want to see the full house house because my mom like really wanted me to go so I'm hoping like by chance that they'll take us there I'm gonna go oh my god <laughs> it's a lot to deal with honestly my hair I don't even know what happened <laughs> we get to go on this thing and explore San Fran which is so cute and cool and exciting we're on the trolley and we're gonna explore and I'm very excited summer with me I literally have no idea what's going on we just got off the trolley and we're walking somewhere not sure where not sure what we're doing but you guys will find out at the same time that I find out. It's been a really fun day so far. We've just kind of met with Sephora collection, done all that, learned about some new products. It's really hot in San Francisco. I didn't expect this. That's why I took off my turtleneck I was wearing earlier. Also, because it looked like I had like 1,200 chins with it on. So, you know, that's not a vibe. Anyway, I keep touching my hair and being annoying, so I'll see you guys when I find out what's going on. <laughs> this is a moment for you. Wait, what are we doing? Are you hated ladies? What is that? Oh my god! <laughs> oh! <laughs> yes! Wait, I need a picture in front of it! What the? I'm so confused! That's so weird! I don't know which one the Full House House is, but one of them. Alright, so. What we've learned, I FaceTimed my mom and she told me that these houses aren't actually the full house house. It's on Broderick Street, but this lawn is where they shot like the opening scene um, for full house, like in the theme song. And I think that's where they all like come and sit on the picnic and they're like, da da da, whatever. I honestly don't really know, but that was really cool. I feel like I got to see a part of my mom's young adulthood. <laughs> Hi guys, I just got back to my room. I am extremely tired. I'm gonna take my makeup off with these Sephora Collection makeup wipes. I just need to get all this stuff off my face. We have dinner with like all the ambassadors and none of like the Sephora people or anything tonight. It's just all the ambassadors. I'm like the worst with remembering names. So I need to like go back and make sure I know all the girls' names. Well, I know like Summer, obviously, Sage and Kyra because we were ambassadors last year. But there's like 10 of us now, so it's a lot of new people to meet in one day. Apparently this lip thing is really hard to get off. <laughs> this lasted all day too, well. I don't think I'm gonna wear makeup to dinner. I'm gonna wear leggings and my sweatshirt and be comfortable. Morning guys, it's obviously the next day, as you can tell. I'm with Kyra. Hi. <laughs> um, we're going to the headquarters. It's like 7 a.m. right now. What'd they say? I think we're going to the Sephora store, like the Sephora retailer. Oh, uh, uh, okay, well, we're going to the store. <laughs> I know so much. And we're getting, I think, a light breakfast. And then we have brunch at like 10.30. And then we go to Chinatown, and we shoot all day. And then I'm leaving at 2.30 I think my flight is um, and we wrap at like 1 so I might be cutting it close I might have to leave a little bit early also how cute are these boots they're from nasty gal I'll link them down below and then I'm wearing my jeans from revolve this is the setup we have like all the new products which I'm gonna do like a whole get ready with me probably at the end of this vlog and then I got myself pressed juice ready for my tutorial <laughs> All right, guys, so you know I'm obsessed with Press Freeze. This is the same flavor as the vanilla one, but it's just kind of not the same. Like, the texture's not really the same, you know? So I'm having a hard time taking it down. 
Yeah. So we're playing around. Look at all these skin tints. Look at all these chickens. Look at all these chickens. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, now we're Summer and I are like delusional. <laughs> Hi everyone. So as you can tell, I'm obviously back in my bathroom, which means I'm home. I had the most amazing time in San Francisco with Sephora Collection. And now I get to do a little get ready with me because I'm home. I have all the new products. So it's gonna be super quick. I'm kind of in a rush because I'm gonna go out with some friends. So this is perfect since I wanna look super natural and light and all that jazz. I've showered already and stuff, but since I was traveling and all that, I'm going to wash my face. So I'm gonna be using the Sephora Collection Cleansing Oil in Balm. This is an amazing kind of like makeup remover, facial cleanser that really breaks down the makeup, easily removes it. What's really cool about this balm is when it touches your skin, it transforms into an oil, so it's not gonna strip your skin or leave it dry or anything. It's gonna really gently and easily remove all the makeup without obviously like killing your skin or being bad for your skin. It's also cruelty free, which I know a lot of you guys always ask about. The best part, honestly, it just effectively cleans everything and you're gonna be left with no impurities or anything it lifts all that up cleans your eye makeup waterproof makeup which is like the hardest thing in the world so I'm just rubbing this all over my skin and rinsing it off okay so once we are all cleansed our skin feels nice and clean I'm gonna go in with the makeup now okay so off camera really quickly I just put a little eye cream and moisturizer on um, just to prep my skin and now I'm going to be taking my Sephora collection bright future fluid tint skin tint sunscreen broad spectrum SPF 25 I tried this in um, San Francisco and it is gorgeous you guys are gonna freak out I know it looks like I'm wearing a very dark shade but the thing with this is you can use like a little bit of a darker shade and it kind of ends up matching you and like makes you a little bit tanner without looking like it's not your shade. I know that's hard to explain, but one of the girls was explaining that to us. So I'm just gonna apply this like so. I know this looks crazy right now, but just wait. So as you can see, I am just blending out the skin tint right now. It has an SPF of 25, which is obviously really good. If you're going out, you need this in the summer, the spring, or even in the winter, it's good to protect your skin. I learned this at the headquarters. It's really cool because the lightweight formula is blended with lemon extract, which helps the complexion appear like more shiny and luminous and glowy and just gorgeous. It's also super moisturizing, so it creates a really fresh and healthy looking glow. Okay, so after I am done with that, I am just going to blend out this lighter concealer. I put any concealer you guys have works. You guys know Laura Mercier translucent powder is my favorite. Whatever you want to use is totally fine. So these are the Sephora Collection Bright Future Radiant Luminizers. These are three gorgeous shades that I got wet because I put them too close to my sink. <laughs> so you can put these under your eyes, your cupid's bow, and other like targeted areas that they're designed for. I'm going to apply them kind of to my cheek and my cupid's bow. You guys are going to die when you see them. I'm going to use this shade called Champagne, but they also have them in shade Cognac and Rosé, which is like a light pink and a more gold. And this one's kind of like a champagne-y pinkish gold, like a mix. You guys can wear this alone or on top of your foundation and concealer. I am personally going to wear it on top. Um, alone is gorgeous. Obviously, on top of products is also gorgeous. It doesn't like settle into your fine lines or create streaks or anything, which is really nice. So it's very subtle. It is one of those products that looks like you're glowing from within. I know I talk about Sephora Collection all the time. I'm obviously one of the ambassadors. I'm obviously super obsessed with the brand. Um, but if you guys are on a budget, this is high-end makeup. Like Sephora Collection is kind of known for having high-end makeup for more reasonable pricing. I think people don't realize like these types of products are made in the same types of factories in these high-end places like NARS and La Mercier and all those great amazing brands but they just have more affordable prices because of their packaging and stuff. This literally just glides right on top of my makeup and kind of gives like a glowing from within look. I'm putting on my cupid's bow. <gasps> Gotta go, I'm sorry, I love that. And then you guys know I'm obsessed with my button nose highlight, so this applicator makes it super easy. It's so cute. I'm just glowing today, people. I'm gonna snap my fingers and then come back with eye makeup on. Ready, one, two, three. 
I just put a little eyeliner and mascara on, nothing crazy. Now I'm gonna do a lip color. You guys know I always talk about these for collection lip stories. They're $8, they're the creamiest lipsticks in the game. I've said countless amounts of things on my Instagram and channel, and I was just hosting an Instagram giveaway of these. Definitely check it out. I was giving away a whole vault, which is all these lipsticks. There are 40 shades, they're incredible. So I kinda wanna do something fun and like a brighter shade today because I obviously have very neutral makeup on. So I think I'm going to go in with this shade from the Global Citizen compartment. <laughs> um, and this one is called First Class, shade 25. It's just gorgeous orangey red. So it comes with three finishes, matte, creamy, and metal. This one is a matte. You guys, $8 and they're so creamy. Take my hair out really quick. Wipe away that powder. I don't really want to contour or do anything. I feel like this looks pretty natural and good. So this is my little get ready with me. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I will have all the products linked down below, of course. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. I had so much fun with the other ambassadors. And obviously, I love finishing off the video with a little get ready with me with some of the new launches. Because, I don't know, I just feel like you guys definitely like when I kind of do more affordable things. So getting to be a brand ambassador for a company that resonates with that message and wants to spread that is really cool. And I'm super stoked to be a part of it. So, I talk with my hands a lot. These lipsticks are actually crazy. Oh, you know what, actually, before I go, I kinda wanna try putting this color in my inner corner to highlight. Ooh. Oh my god. That's a look. All right, signing off now. That was exciting. I used the shade Rosé for that. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I will see you in my next video. Bye.